Okay, I'm here in Fredericton and I got a guy I'm going to interview and this should be very interesting. Hey there, what's yes. your name? Robert Duguay. And you are? I'm working uh, for the Poverty Reduction Initiative. Uh, it's an initiative that the government put in place to try to find, to develop a plan, a poverty reduction plan for New Brunswick. Uh, it's something that has been developed in other provinces, uh, Ontario, Quebec, Nova Scotia, Newfoundland. And at this time, the government felt that it was a time also to hear, to look at what we are doing to help people and what we can do to uh, what actions could be uh, developed to uh, reduce poverty in New Brunswick. It was announced this morning or yesterday that you're going to go form like a workshop and yeah. go around the province yes. and to listen to the less fortunate uh, concerns. Can you explain it? Well, yes. The way it's going to work, it's not like a consultation. There's a difference here between public engagement and consultation. Uh, a, a, a regular consultation, what we have all the time around the province. It's when uh, government representatives will go in meetings and people will talk and then they will come back and develop a plan. Here it's different. It's what we call public engagement. It's, it's, uh, it's everyone that's been involved, that will be involved in the development of the plan. So that's why we have what we call as a first step. There's three steps. First is dialogue sessions, and then we'll have round tables, uh, and then we'll have a final forum the next fall. So the dialogue sessions are meetings we have this month, January and February 2009, and we'll have 14 meetings around the province. It's not a place where people will make presentations. It's a, it's a meetings where we're going to have uh, group discussions. So people will have, uh, how you call it, uh, a moment ago you said, you used the word. Yellow. Uh, uh, in English you say, uh, working group? Working group, a workshop. Workshop, yes, thanks. So w working groups or workshops, so people will work in small groups during these meetings at tables and they will uh, talk about what caused poverty and uh, what could be done to uh, try to reduce poverty. So this will be done and then after that there will be a, all, all what has been said will be put into a document and it will pass on to the next step which will be round tables with experts including people living on poverty. Uh, my God, about uh, what it take just one city a uh, couple of days to listen to all the problems? Again, we try to do different than a simple consultation. We try to develop, a, I mean it's a process all the time, I mean in Nova Scotia it took uh, a year and a half, in Ontario it took over a year. It's, it's, uh, it's a lengthy process because you have to involve people. Because if you, if it's, it will be a standard consultation, government will come and just go around the province, listen to people, and people talk and then they come back and they will do it our way. But the way now it's done, it's a, what we call again, it's a public engagement, it's different. I it's mean, people it's involved good. in meeting uh, the, the plan. Who's going to be the moderators that's going to travel and have to listen to all these problems? All we are all not, problems? well, we, it's, it's, we have staff, we're, I would say we are not listening. We are at the table, the government is at the table as a partner, as at the same level as any others, any people involved. So that will, the way it's going to work is we'll have, again, it's a kind of a workshop or group discussions, working groups that it will work and the, with that we'll get information, we put that together. What caused poverty, what could be done, we'll put that together. You know what, you are so good. Wait one second, this is part one, we're going to have a part two. Wait one second.